Life isn't about waiting for the storm to pass. It's about learning to dance in the rain. I know that today as a proud wife to my loving husband, Jim, but in early 2005, I did not. During that cold January, I was diagnosed with lupus. I was very sick, having just suffered three miscarriages and two strokes. I didn't understand my body anymore. What I discovered was that my immune system was attacking and destroying everything I thought I knew about it. Then, in 2006, life handed me yet another challenging situation when a surgical error left me bedridden for six months. At this point, I was in such utter despair having to deal with yet another painful health issue. I know what it feels like to want to have a child and be told you shouldn't try again because it could take your life. I know what it feels like to have every joint and muscle in your body burn as though you just walked through fire. And I know what it feels like to wake up in the morning thinking you have the flu, but it's not. It's another flare. It took all my emotional and physical strength to pull through, and there was a moment when I wasn't sure I had it in me. Now, years later, I still deal with lupus and issues from that surgical error, but I know I'm a strong woman, and all these years have proven God's will. I've helped raise funds as an executive member of the Lupus Research Alliance of New Jersey, and I am continuing to raise awareness as an ambassador for the Lupus Foundation of America. I'm most proud of my social support network called Butterfly Miracles Living with Lupus and Beyond. It tells my story and how I'm helping other women deal with their own health complications. Through my Butterfly Miracles podcast, I'm able to reach women worldwide to help them address issues and misunderstandings and to help strengthen those who feel discouraged. My social media group serves as an inspirational haven for women to share our setbacks and our successes. My ultimate purpose and mission are to help end this cruel mystery of lupus and to assist those who can't easily assist themselves, just like me 15 years ago. So if you have a storm in your life that's threatening your well-being, remember it's not always about waiting for the storm to pass. It's about learning to dance even when there's pouring rain. I know I am a survivor, I am a cheerleader, and I am a wife. I am Heather Moran, Mrs. East Coast International 2021.